Giving children the best education they can get starts with making sure they're coming to school every day. In Detroit, students missing school on a regular basis is a massive problem. It really is, and as our Kimberly Gill has been reporting for weeks now, the district is working on solutions. She joins us live from Mumford High School where parents and educators are about to gather to go in depth on this issue. Kim? Hi, Karen and Devin. Good evening. As you mentioned, all month long, I've been doing stories highlighting this issue of chronic absenteeism in Detroit public schools. It's an issue that has only been exacerbated since the pandemic, and the district is taking some extreme measures to try to reverse those numbers. One of the things DPSCD is doing to combat chronic absenteeism is they've hired attendance agents like Effie Harris. Good morning. She arrives early and greets each student every day, many by name. Are we riding the bus today or no? Yes. She builds a connection with the kids and identifies why they're absent or can't get to school on time. It can start off with a phone call home to say, uh, mom, dad, you know, so-and-so has not been here. What's going on? The reason students miss class may have to do more with their families not having stable access to resources that will help get kids to school. That was the case with Janetta Burnett. Janetta's daughter passed away, and Janetta immediately took over the care and custody of her daughter's five children. Retired and on a fixed income, Janetta didn't know how she would make ends meet or get five kids to different schools. All right, have a great day. But then she found out about the district's family resource distribution center. I ain't got nobody else, you know, like no family member, nobody really helped me. But since they came, it's like family. I know. Yeah. You know, they, they, they support me with the kids uniform. I didn't have it. And I, I felt very blessed because when they came to me, they had nothing. Detroit is such a massive district. There is such a big need. If there wasn't a resource like this, it would be a lot harder. The Family Resource Distribution Center is a place where DPSCD families can receive resources such as school supplies, coats, water, dry goods, and hygiene products for free. It's been a struggle, a real struggle. But when you got support, that's a big help. It is. Janetta is just an amazing woman there. Uh, and those are just a couple of ways that the district is working to try to combat this issue of chronic absenteeism. So I'm here live at Mumford High School where this town hall is set to take place. It's from 7 to 8 tonight. It's open to the public. Uh, Superintendent Dr. Nikolai Vidi is going to be here as well as other school leaders working to tackle this problem. And you still have time to get down here. Again, it's tonight from 7 p.m. until 8 p.m. If you can't make it in person, you can watch on clickondetroit.com or local four plus. Let's send it back to you, Karen and Devin in the studio. Yeah, Kimberly, now you mentioned it's open to the public. So does that mean that parents actually get a chance to ask some of the questions that are on their minds? Oh, absolutely. Yes, we're, we're going to uh, hear and get questions from the audience, uh, parents, as well as community issues, because Karen, this is this is more than just a school issue. It's a community issue. So I expect that there will be plenty of people here that will be asking questions and uh, and we welcome those. Dr. Nikolai Vidi will be here answering questions as well as our panel. You can see the setup behind me. Such an important night. All right. We appreciate it. Thanks, Kimberly.